Hey everybody, welcome to my Uncut Gems movie review. I watched this movie uh, maybe a week and a half ago, and um, it stars M. Sandler. Uh, I don't know who directed this movie. Let me see. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have probably uh, prepared. Uh, if I had to describe this movie uh, in one word, it would be uh, anxious. This movie uh, caused me to feel a lot of anxiety. Um, it's directed by uh, the, the Safe Safety Brothers. I have no idea who these guys are. I've, I've never, uh, yeah, I've never seen any of their work. It's an A24 film. A24 is a, to me, it's a very punk rock studio. They do a lot of great, great original movies. Um, I like to support anything they do. I, I think they're a, they're an, they're an artist studio. And this movie uh, stars Adam Sandler, who. Uh, I hate <laughs> 90 percent of his movies um, I don't think he's funny I think he has zero comedic talent everything that I've liked of Adam Sandler has been when he gets serious why does he do these idiotic comedies I haven't seen any of his stupid Netflix movies the first movie of his that I actually kind of liked was uh, Big Daddy where it was a little bit more serious I, I just don't think he's funny little Nicky Billy Madison my god Billy Madison just made me angry the spoiled, privileged brat, a complete imbecile. Meanwhile, at the time, I think I was busting my ass in college, and this dude's living this high life, and he's a complete imbecile. He didn't even graduate high school. But but this movie, um, it's not an Adam Sandler movie. It's it's an A24 film starring Adam Sandler. Um, and his character is the biggest piece of shit you could ever imagine. All he does is lie. He's got a g serious gambling addiction. Someone will loan him money or they'll give him something as collateral. Then he'll go pawn that and go make bets on it because he just can't stop betting. He's constantly scheming. He makes like, I don't know if he's got real gems or, or whatever. He runs like an underhanded black market jewelry and watch. I think they're counterfeit Rolexes he makes. I think he counterfeits everything. He's constantly scheming and lying. He's full of shit. He is just the epitome of a piece of shit. He's just full of shit. He'd be like, let me call this guy right now. And it's like, nobody's on the phone. Like, he does, oh my god. His character is... I, at, no time, at no point did I root for him. I hated his character. But, but I, I, I was supposed to. And uh, Julia Fox, another newcomer, hasn't been... I think she was in a short film. Oh my god. This woman is absolutely to die for beautiful. She... She's got an incredible career ahead of her. As long as she doesn't do anything stupid to mess it up. I'm already following her on Instagram. Oh, my God. Kevin Garnett is in this, too. And Kevin Garnett, he did a good job acting. He played himself. But he still had to act. And he did a good job. He did a very good job. Um, so, you know, maybe as long as he plays himself, whatever, we could use him in movies. Um, he... Um, yeah, he played himself, so, again, uh, and there's a couple, I think there's a musician in here that I'm not too familiar with, but, uh, anyways, I give this movie a 90 out of 100. A24 always makes great movies, um, you know, they, they don't have that, those whole corporate overlord things, you know, go, going on, they're, uh, they're a smaller studio that I think is very reputable, um, and I enjoy their, their films. Anyways, I highly recommend you go see Uncut Gems, um, yeah, go go watch it. Go watch it. It's one of the better movies I've seen this year. Um, did you guys see it? Uh, again, 90 out of 100. It's an anxious movie. It makes you very anxious. But uh, let me know what you guys thought. Did you see it? Did you not? Did you like it? Do you not care? Leave your comments below. And I'll see you later. Okay, bye.